A declot is done in the, in the following fashion. The patient's first taken to the access suite where we talk to them about the procedure and explain to them the complications of what we're going to do. And then they're taken to a special room where the staff prepares their arm in a way so that we can prevent infection. It's draped in a certain way so that then the access is exposed and we use some local anesthetics while we put in very large tubes similar to the dialysis needles that they have at the dialysis unit. And with those tubes, we introduce wires and long tubes with balloons on the end. And we use those tubes and those wires to take pictures and to crush the clot there and to expand the areas of scarring that have occurred in the access that have caused the access to close down. And then at the end, we withdraw everything in there so there's very small little holes that we either put a stitch in or sometimes just with direct pressure, just like the dialysis needles. And the patient can then go about their business or back to the dialysis unit as the case may be.